I'm Lydia and today we'll be drawing a snail together. Yes, a snail. Um, so we'll be doing a bit more surreal, like not real. So here is a snail that I have drawn before and this new shell. We're going to change it into a flower, like lots of different colours. I did it on a very big brown paper but we're just going to do it on a white paper today and I hope you like it so as you see I got a sheet of paper white pencil and this match coloring pencils okay so we need a lot of coloring pencils because we're actually going to blend it in so you can see that I have blended in from crayon like blue light blue and white and then orange peach i think and yellow and green pink yeah so that's the color i got from here see i got i got the red pile so these are the red pile this is the green pile with aqua if you have it this is the pink pile and this is the blue pile now you can see i have all these piles now I have one more color which is peach. Since it's a white paper, we're not gonna draw like white on it so you can't see it. And on brown paper we can color it in white. So we're gonna use um peach to color the body. And if you like or if you have those, um if you have those crayons or something or pastel that you have like those, make sure they have all those colours. You can use them as well. Okay. So first, we're gonna draw the eye, the eyeballs. So we're gonna find a find the middle and then go on top of here because we're gonna do the body around this. And this is the whole entire shape. So we're gonna draw one circle like that. Another circle. Make sure it's apart, not too close and not too far because they don't have too far eyes or too close eyes okay now we have that we're gonna draw another small circle don't color it it yet now have that and have that now we can color it in you can use your pencil or you can use colored pencil like those or you can use a fine liner or a marker to do it Just like that. Now we're gonna do the um the head. Now, how to do the head is we need two um standards underneath those. I'm gonna draw it down and then draw the other one like this. Okay. Make sure this the right one has to be a bit curved and this one has to be a bit curved as well. Now, we have to do the, the inner parts, the light, because when you have to do this, I'm going to curve it around like this and then connect this one by doing it as well. Same thing. So that's the face. Now, I haven't done the smile yet, so we're going to do behind like this and then do small smile just underneath to the big curved upside down rainbow okay now when you have done this we're gonna connect the body by using this part and then go down like that now, like me, I used one stroke to go down, but if you're very bad at using circles or doing ovos, you can do it slightly like this. Okay, make sure this, this gap has to be big enough, because we're going to do something later on that. So then we're going to curve it around. You can twist your body around like me. I'm going to 
make the big bigger. Okay, I think that's big enough. About you can use your ruler to measure how long it is. My one is about 18 centimeters. You can be different or um same. Now we're gonna connect the other one the same. By using one stroke or tiny little strokes. Gonna connect the last bit on the very end of a point. Okay, now it looks like a slug. So now when you finish this slug, we're gonna draw the shell. Now first we have to draw a circle to see how big it is so then we know where to draw the flowers. I'm gonna slightly curve it down until you get to the end of that. Now we're gonna draw I'm just gonna fix your shell not too hard because then we're gonna rub it out. Okay. So now we, you can do the flowers and the leaves. So we have to decide how many flowers they are. Okay, I think mine's gonna be seven. And there's gonna be different shapes. So, so I'm gonna start from here first. I'm gonna draw a very big circle. And I can draw another small circle to make it very good. But then you can draw something a bit patterned so it looks very much like a flower and then you can design your own petals or you can follow my petal petals to draw the flowers Here's my first flower, looking very small. Now I can draw another one over here. So you're gonna use your pencil and slightly color the um the areas of here. So we're gonna use our gray lid to um to draw the shell again, but this time we have to use it for shading. So we're gonna draw around the surface. back to where we finished over here. So first gonna use this 
from the very very um end then you're gonna slightly change it to this and then change it to this and then you can change it to peach if you like now we're gonna do the coloring and i hope you like it As you see, I finished my colouring. I used a lot of blending on the flowers with my pencils and for this for the snail body I just used peach to colour it in. And for the leaves I just add a lot of green and I used those to add them more colourful. Now I need to do sign on name somewhere you can sign it somewhere in the middle over here or you can sign it over there on the very bottom over here i think i'm just gonna sign it on the very bottom that looks good and i hope you like it i hope you like to draw this snail with the flower shell and thank you for watching this video bye